find all possible values of x given that x equals root of a squared plus a plus 1 minus root of a squared minus a plus 1. a is a real number. By rearranging the equation, we can now write x plus root of a squared minus a plus 1 equals root of a squared plus a plus 1. Next, we square both sides of the equation. The left-hand side of the equation can be written as x squared plus 2x root of a squared minus a plus 1 plus a squared minus a plus 1. The right-hand side of the equation can be written as a squared plus a plus 1. A squared on the left-hand side of the equation and that on the right-hand side of the equation cancel 1 on the left-hand side of the equation and that on the right-hand side of the equation cancel. By simplifying, we can now write 2x root of a squared minus a plus 1 equals 2a minus x squared. Now we square both sides of the equation. The left hand side of the equation can be written as 4x squared times a squared minus a plus 1. The right hand side of the equation can be written as 4a squared minus 4x squared plus x to the power of 4. The left hand side of the equation can be written as 4x squared a squared minus 4x squared a plus 4x squared minus 4x squared a on the left hand side of the equation and that on the right hand side of the equation cancel. By simplifying, we can now write 4x squared a squared minus 4a squared equals x to the power of 4 minus 4x squared. The left hand side of the equation can be written as 4x squared minus 4 times a squared, a squared equals x to the power of 4 minus 4x squared over 4x squared minus 4. We can factorize the numerator and the denominator and write equals x squared times x squared minus 4 over 4 times x squared minus 1. Since a squared is greater than or equal to 0, x squared is greater than or equal to 
zero thus x squared minus four over x squared minus one is greater than or equal to zero. We derived inequality one. Now we write x equals root of a squared plus a plus one minus root of a squared minus a plus one, which we were given in the question. Now we multiply this algebraic expression by root of a squared plus a plus one plus root of a squared minus a plus one over root of a squared plus a plus one plus root of a squared minus a plus one, which is of course just equal to one. Next, we multiply this algebraic expression by the numerator of this fraction, which can be written as root of a squared plus a plus one or squared minus root of a squared minus a plus one or squared, which is a difference of two squares. Next, we simplify the numerator a squared and minus a squared cancel one and minus one cancel. We can simplify the numerator and write two a. So we can now write two a over root of a squared plus a plus one plus root of a squared minus a plus one. Since root of a squared plus the modulus of a plus one must be greater than the modulus of a, so the modulus of x is less than the modulus of 2a over a, which is equal to 2 plus x squared minus 4 is less than 0. From inequality 1, we have x squared minus 1 is less than 0. Hence, minus 1 is less than x is less than 1.